Welcome to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. It is my privilege to induct the Go-Go. LL Cool J. Clarence Avon. Randy Rhodes. Tina Turner. Todd Rundgren. Charlie Patton. Kraftwerk. Carol King. Gil Scott Hamm. The Foo Fighters. Jay-Z. Now that's rock and roll. What's up, Cleveland? What does LL really stand for? Well, I'm here because I personally think it stands for living legend. LL Cool J is rock and roll. Right here. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> I'd like to thank all of the people who voted for LL to be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame year after year. We love you. Thank you. Mama made it! I am a songwriter first. I've always been a songwriter. But to be a performer, I had to learn how to do it. And James Taylor showed me how to do it, which is get up there and be authentically yourself. And that was my model for, okay, I can do that. Carol, please accept your well-deserved place in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. I want to thank Taylor for carrying the torch forward. You're like my professional granddaughter. <laughs> Tina Turner is who we're here tonight to celebrate. She's made such an imprint on my life, and she's such a beautiful, strong individual. Oh my gosh, first song I heard of hers would have been Nutbush City Limits. Nasty riff that kicks that thing off just like grabbed me, so. It's awesome that she's finally been inducted in on her own. If they're still giving me awards at 81, I must have done something right. You're simply the best. The Go-Go's have been in my personal Hall of Fame since I was six years old. We started out, we had no idea what we were doing. Honestly, we didn't. So, I mean... We, we still from, don't. We still don't which is part we'll of the try. charm of the Go-Go's. <laughs> we're really hoping that young girls and young women are gonna step up and say, I wanna play an instrument, I wanna write songs, I wanna make a difference. I mean, that's like everything to us. This is an incredible honor to induct this next man into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, Jay-Z. I think what's most important for everyone in this room to know is what he means to us what he means to his culture. We were told that hip hop was a fad, much like punk rock, and there were heroes in it. And what made them great is they was 100% authentic to what, who they were. So I was like, oh, I got it. I gotta be 100% authentically myself. Now we're like, yo, I'm the best. I'm telling you, I'm the greatest. But well, one of the greatest. I don't want no problems, LL, all right? We did it, Brooklyn! This band, is one of the greatest rock and roll bands, Foo Fighters! The Foo's go full throttle every time. I was just saying to them in the dressing room, this is it, the fucking rock and roll hall of fame. It's been 20, 25, 30 years, and we stick together like a family. We did it. Thank you all very much. We're at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. It's bad dreams coming true, right?